And there's one more thing happening today that kids will absolutely love, and this is also for a good cause, the Reedy River Duck Derby. And you were saying we're probably going to have good weather. Yeah, now it was hot last year, but this year it's going to be a little bit cooler, especially in the morning. But still, I'm sure the ducks won't mind. They're going to be <laughs> swimming down Falls Park. These little guys, they'll love it. All right, 7 News reporter Katie Solt is there. She's getting ready as organizer <laughs> set up for the fun event. Katie, I'm excited for this. I'm excited too. Soon the, the Falls area is going to be filled with music, games, and of course those 10,000 rubber duckies. I'm joined now live with Candy Serkin, a former Rotary Club president here in Greenville. Candy, talk about how excited you are. This is the 12th annual Duck Derby. I mean, how excited is everybody today? We are extremely excited today. We're so happy to be down here. It's a gorgeous day. I think we're going to have a record crowd. Uh, we're just really, really thrilled to be able to do this for 12 years for the city of Greenville. Now, of course, a lot of fun today with all the activities going on and, of course, the rubber duckies floating down. But this is all for a good cause, of course. So just remind everybody what some of those charities and local philanthropies are that this money is going towards. Okay. Uh, one of the major projects is our big service project that we do, which is Early Act First Night, which is a character education program for middle schoolers and elementary schoolers. Um, we also uh, support Shriners Hospital. Uh, GAIN, which is the Greenville Area Interfaith Hospitality Network, uh, Malden Miracle League, uh, Greenville Symphony, and uh, several others. A lot of great charities and, of course, a lot of fun going on today. I'm excited. I should have bought a duck. Now I wanted to see if I had that lucky duck that could have crossed the finish line, guys. A lot, like you said, lots of fun times, lots of games. Gates open at 1030, but the big race is at 230 this afternoon. That's correct. So. I might actually just stay out here and hang out with the Ducks the rest of the day. I don't know about you guys, but uh, the Duck Derby sounds like a pretty fun day, and it all leads up to the big Kentucky Derby tonight, so that's even I better. know, so many derbies. <laughs> all right, Katie, you mentioned it. What happens if you are that lucky duck that crosses the finish line first? What's on the line here? Well, there's actually quite a big prize on the line, a year's worth of groceries from Publix. That's a pretty big prize, a year's supply of groceries from Publix. Second place takes home an awesome children's play set, and third place takes home a season pass for the Greenville County Rec Center. All great prizes, but again, it's all about those charities that it's really benefiting here locally, all the great charities here in Greenville that it is benefiting. Thank you, guys. Live in downtown Greenville, Katie Solt, 7 News.